almost forgot. Eddie paid me in advance, so here's your share. Six thousand. Not bad. Oh god, police station. Right. Bad. What is this, the Indianapolis Speedway? Oh, what? Wow, that, uh... Oh god. What? Well, is there always that much police around? Or what? Come on. I was gonna say, sure as hell I'm far enough away now. Well, couldn't have picked a worse spot to uh, go to uh, a well, body shop, but... Bloody hell. No, don't. Thank God. Damn. Right. Ah! Change plates. There. Change something. Do it. There we go. Car must be repaired. Well, there you go. I mean, I don't think the money matters at all. It's just a story element, so I don't think it matters at all, actually, so... Um, yeah, let's just upgrade this baby. It's full. Uh, is that all? Radio. Oh no, there we are. I apologize for the dead air, ladies and gents, but we have an update to the shootout that occurred at the I like it. There we go. <sighs> That's it's not the, the way you leave. So we're still wanted ourselves, though. But you know. Time, yet another example of the scourge that is doing its damnedest to break down the walls of decency. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry for the blue language. But course actions demand the course. CLA Empire Classic Radio. I'm Gary Stevens. Well, at least now we're kind of safe from the uh, the cops now. So, I mean, now they will only recognize you if they're really close. So, I don't think that'll happen. I don't think so. Saying that, I know I'm going to be proven wrong, as uh, I almost always am. So. <laughs> We'll see. This time you can't escape and run. I'm holding you responsible. For all. I wonder if I'm going to be stopping by the close door. No, I'm not. Well, you know what? I'll, I'll do it. I'll just stop by there just to make sure it doesn't uh, fuck me over in any way. Just driving around that police officer. Offer me your hardest car Oh, to do really after all this, you care about her. <sighs> Fine. Oh well. Hello. Back me up, Vito. Yeah, you go shoot. I all enough. Please let me go. Oh, Joe, what the fuck, guy? Joe, no. Well, I'm not wanted. Joe is. I'm not. Is that the fucking best you got? Oh, you're in trouble. Fucking idiot. Look at this. Joe, if you can kill them, that's fine with me, because then I can buy some clothes. How about that? Oh, God. Show yourself. This is ridiculous. Mr. Barbaro, you suck. Shoot him! The fuck guy? Thanks. You dragged me into this. Can I just take clothes? Steal it. There we go. Alright. Good. I'm good. Nothing going on here. So there's still a price tag on that hat. It seemed like it was. Well, that was slightly awkward. Oh, this car. 
car. I love these upgraded cars. I don't like the brakes, though. Very underwhelming. Alright, good luck getting your hair for the money. Come by my place when you're done. Okay, I'll see you later. Oh. I'll hand for forgets. What? Would have been so bad if I actually hit that police car. Police are actually worrying me at this point, so. Alright, take the tunnel. It's fine. This entire thing, 40 speed. Damn. Thought it was 60. I'll uh, just watch the mini map for cops, I guess. This is clearly so much better. The difference is so big. This car is actually. A nice middle ground between speed and uh, out of control. I'm just uh, thinking of myself uh, saying, you know, that other car upgraded was uh, nice and stable, but this one is a, li a bit less stable, but very fast. Look at it. Oh god. Please. Be bright when you see it. Goodbye. Even a shame. Wait, this is not our exit. Alright. This is this though. Also, I need gas, apparently. When you see it, we'll part in a shame. Like the second time in the game now. Wow. It really isn't very important. It's more an off more of an off offer thought, isn't it? Get out. Run up. See if we uh, can get another job. Hey. Beto! Hey, thanks for coming by. I knew I could count on you. What for? <clears throat> Frank's organizing a sit down with the other bosses, and he took almost all my guys as bodyguards. So I don't have nobody around to handle this here job for me. Derek, these guys still don't want to work. What? Why? Because of that deadbeat you fired. Hey. Shit. Well, Vito, that other thing will have to wait. Can you help us out here with this first? What's happening? Well, this deadbeat didn't come to work for a whole week. Pretended he was sick. Total bullshit. So I fired his ass. Anyway, some of his buddies are upset, and they're threatening to strike. All I gotta do is show up with a few guys who look like they mean business. That'll scare them, and they'll forget all about it. I give you a thousand bucks. Are you in? All right. I ain't gonna say no to that kind of money. All right. All you need to do is stand behind me and look tough. Right, Steve? We'll see. No. <laughs> no. Oh, he's actually coming along himself. Oh, I wonder if this uh, is going to be what I think is this is going to be. These fucking guys really think who the fuck they are. This ain't the first time I have problems with them, you know. Know how many of them there is? 
three, four, ten. How the fuck should I know? Does it matter? Oh, no, it's just, uh, what are we gonna do to him? All depends on how the, uh, labor negotiations go. Just let me do all the talking. I don't need just opening your mouths and proving how stunard you are. So, what's the problem here, fellas? We want you to give Big John his job back. It's me that decides who gets hired and fired around here. And I say he's fired. All we're asking is for you to hire him back. He's got a family. He needs a job. I've made my decision. See, I told you. Easy does it, Vinny. We want to do this Easy. peacefully. We bust our asses day in and day out for this fat fuck. And if anything ever happens to us, he'll screw us over Blow just like he did John. now, young man. I don't want to hear another word about that fucking dead. Who are you calling a deadbeat? A crate fell on the poor guy while he was working. For you. Broke both his damn hands. Well, that's his fucking problem, not mine. Now I suggest you just get back to work before somebody else's hands get you broke. You goddamn bastard! You fellas are really starting to piss me off. There's no need for violence. Please, put it down. We don't want no trouble. Don't look that way to me. Right now, looks like you got big trouble, don't you? Now, if you all don't want to start looking for new jobs, you'll be back to work in the next ten minutes. You see, Vito, all they do is bitch and moan. Vito? You're Skeletor's boy, ain't you? I, your dad, used to talk about you all the time. You look just like him. But what are you doing working for this bastard? After what he did to your old Shut man? Shut your fucking mouth right now. Don't listen to him, Vito. He's full of shit. Come on, let's go. Full of shit, huh? That bastard killed your father, Vito. What? They're just trying to get under your skin, Derek. Hey, stop pointing that gun Why at don't me. Don't you ask him how your dad drowned Trap. that night? We seen him take a walk with Steve. And then Steve come back alone and all wet. Stop pointing that thing at me. What the hell happened with my father, Derek? Are you nuts or what? Who are you gonna trust, me or these now unemployed losers? We known each other for a long time, Vito. Think of all Why the things- you all wet, Steve? You dive in and try to save him? Because he wouldn't stay underwater. Keep your mouth shut! Vito, you swore an oath. I was there. Our loyalty to the family is greater than to our own families. Tell that to my mother. <sighs> Should I kill him? No, not here. We'll settle things with him later. You disappoint me, Vito. You really do. I'm gonna do a hell of a lot more than disappoint you, Derek. Shoot. Your dad. Not right now. I gotta get that fuck before he runs away. Time to teach that fat fuck a lesson. Vinny, where'd you get that? Doesn't matter. All right. Okay, the odds are even. Now let's teach that fat fuck a lesson. All right. Follow me, guys. This is crazy, fellas. Some extra fun. Shouldn't be doing this. Let's go and handle him. Stop your back. To be honest, I was. Well. I was expecting uh, an option to actually kill Derek or, you know, the innocents. I was totally ready to kill Derek before I learned that, so... I'm all fine with killing that guy. No fucking problem. I mean, they're honest people, right? So... <coughs> Wait, pick up C-96 pistol. Yeah, fell. Well. Where are you guys? Still not dead. What?
oh boy.